Hey guys, Jennifer here with The Family Fudge. Now this week we're on the move and I have lots of fun lunch ideas to share with you. This week we're packing everything up, having lunch at 35,000 feet in the air and we're moving into a brand new house in a city we've never even been to before. And I wanna give a big thanks to Audible for sponsoring this video. Now don't forget to hit that red subscribe button if you're new and click the notification bell that way you don't miss out on any of our videos. Now let's get on to the lunches. Hey guys, and welcome to Monday. Now since we're going out of town tomorrow, I wanted to make today's lunch super easy. And I also wanted to use up things I had on hand. So I went ahead and popped in a frozen pizza. This is just pepperoni. I'm also giving the kids a banana because I want to use them all up before we go. We have a yogurt tube, celery, sugar snap peas, and of course, ranch to dip them in. And to drink, the kids are just gonna have water today. Okay guys, come tell me what you thought of this lunch. What was your favorite part? My favorite was the pizza. My favorite was the pizza too. Oh, what about you though? And also the banana. Um, I really like the pizza, the banana, um, the drink, and that's all. Mm -hmm. And while these guys were having lunch, I did my nails so they don't look horrible anymore. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Oh, we're headed to the airport tomorrow. Are you guys excited? Yeah. yeah. Well, you better get a good night's sleep because we gotta get up when it's still dark. Good morning, guys, and happy Tuesday. Right now, it is super early in the morning. We're about to head out to the airport very soon, so I need to throw together the kids' lunches. Now, since I have to get these lunches through security and the kids are gonna eat them on the plane, I wanted to make sure to get foods that were all sealed up so I don't have to worry about things opening or spilling or germs or anything like that. So today, I'm actually making it PB&J day. I'm gonna throw in some of these Uncrustables. Right now, they're frozen. Frozen, but by lunchtime they'll be nice and thawed. Now these ones are actually reduced sugar, which I like, and they're also on whole wheat. Next, I'm gonna throw in some really fun foodles. I usually find these at Walmart. Inside these containers, there are slices of apple, cubes of cheese, and Mickey-shaped cheese crackers. So I have one for each of the kids. Next, I'm throwing in some veggie chips. These are so cute. They happen to be shaped like bunnies. Perfect for spring. Now since this is a five hour flight, and of course we're waiting at the airport as well, I wanted to make sure to throw in some extra snacks. So I have some of these whole wheat fig bars. And then for a special treat, I have some of these Annie's Really Peelies. So these ones are the strawberry flavor and they're very much like a fruit by the foot, if you know what those are. Now, unfortunately, I can't put any liquids in here, so no applesauce, no yogurt, no juice, nothing like that. Oh yes, and for Griffin, my toddler, I'm gonna give him a PB&J as well and a little Paw Patrol snack container. This has apples, grapes, string cheese, and graham cracker cookies. Now when we fly as a family, I usually take the girls with me and my husband takes the boys and we try to make it through the flight without any meltdowns. Sometimes it happens anyway. One thing I love to do on flights is to listen to audiobooks and there's no better place to listen than Audible. So when we travel as a family, I like to bring my headphones and the kids bring theirs and we like to bring an audio splitter so several of us can listen to the same book together. On this trip, I actually let Mackenzie choose one of the great books available on Audible. There's really so many to choose from. And she picked the Audible original, Jack's Big Secret. Right now, you guys, you can get your first audiobook for free along with two selected Audible original titles when you start your 30-day trial. So take the time to listen on Audible. All you have to do is visit audible.com slash familyfudge or text familyfudge to 500-500 to get started. Hey guys, and happy Wednesday. So today we're at Costco doing a big grocery haul 
But right now, it is lunchtime. And instead of just getting regular pizza or hot dogs, I decided to go with something a little bit healthier. Now, not all of these things actually came from the food court. I went ahead and picked up a vegetable platter from the back of the store. We're gonna go ahead and share this and whatever's left over, we'll just put the lid on and take it back to the house. And then I got three of these delicious acai bowls. This is basically a smoothie bowl, but they're kind of big. So I'm thinking every two people can share one. It has blueberries and strawberries and granola, of course. I also got a couple bottles of water, some lemonade, and then I got a smaller tray of the rolled sandwiches. So these are very similar to what I usually make at home. There's turkey, cheese, lettuce, and tomatoes. Now, as you can see, the kids really enjoyed the veggie platter, especially Griffin. I think most of his lunch was vegetables. And then of course, we all love the smoothie bowls. Those are definitely a big hit, especially with Miss Lily, who loves fruit. Hi guys, and happy Thursday. So the kids just finished up with their schoolwork, and we have some plans to go look at some houses. We're gonna check out some model homes and see if we like them or not. So today's lunch is totally portable. We're either gonna take it to the park or we may end up eating it in the car. I'm not quite sure yet. Okay guys, so the main course for today is a sub sandwich. I got one for each of the kids and one for me to try. I've been told that the sandwiches from this store called Publix are very popular. And the most popular sandwich that they have there actually has chicken tenders on it. So that's what these are. There's chicken and cheese and lettuce and tomatoes and pickles right in here. So we have those. I'm probably gonna end up cutting them for the kids because it's kind of big. Now to go along with that, we have lots of fruits and veggies and some boiled peanuts. I picked these up at a gas store called Racetrack and my kids love these. We got these a lot when we were in Georgia and I didn't know that they were popular in Florida too, but they are. If you've never had one of these, Gosh, I don't even know how to describe them. They're, they're kind of mushy and they're a little bit salty. For their fruit and veggies today, I have strawberries, baby carrots, and sugar snap peas. And I have them in these really fun containers that are perfect for the car. These actually stack up like this. You screw them all together. And then they also have a lid. In a minute here, I'll show you how, how it looks when it's all put together. So that'll be fun. I also got some Jif bars. These ones are chocolate peanut butter. And I also got a regular peanut butter one. So those are really good. And then to drink today, the kids are just gonna take their water. So here they are when they're all put together. These snack containers are so cool. I actually found them at Walgreens, you know, like the drugstore. So yeah, There's one for each of the big kids. And then let me give you a peek at the sandwich. Okay, so here's a peek inside the little chicken sandwich. This one is the spicy one, so I think I'm gonna try that one. Okay guys, so far, what's your favorite part of this lunch? Sandwich and the peanuts. The sandwich and the bar. What's your favorite part? The granola bar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so one of the things we wanna do while we're here is check out some houses. So far, we've looked at houses in Utah, in Georgia, but since we're still not 100% sure where we wanna live, now it's time to check out Florida. Overall, we're not looking for anything that's super big or fancy, but a large kitchen would certainly make it easier to make all these fun lunches. And it wouldn't hurt to be closer to Disney World, that's for sure. Mommy! Mm -hmm. Secret hideout, please. A secret hideout? Uh -huh. Let me see, where is it? It's in here and you get the slipper. Hey guys, and happy Friday. Today we're having a field trip and a picnic. Later, we're gonna go head into a history museum, but first, we're gonna dig into lunch. For the main course today, I went ahead and picked up some Cuban sandwiches. I found the most authentic ones I could in the area from a place called Buchitos, but we've never had Cuban sandwiches before. I'm told they have ham, roasted pork, cheese, mustard, and pickles, so they sound delicious. So I got two big sandwiches. We'll go ahead and cut them up and the kids can share. To go along with that, I also picked up a small bag of these chili lime potato chips. We've never tried these before, so hopefully they won't be too spicy. For the vegetable today, I brought a big salad so the kids could share it. I also brought some apples that I got 
got from Costco yesterday. And then to drink, I also got the kids some of our favorite good to grow apple juices. So that's pretty much it, but I do want to go ahead and give you a peek at the Cuban sandwich, just in case you're curious. Here it is. Ooh, it's still warm and the cheese is melted. It's looking delicious. I hope the kids agree. And then of course, after lunch, we're going to head into the museum. You give it a I thumbs did. up or a thumbs down? I'm thumbs side. <laughs> to the side. One, two, three, tie it. Now the area that we had our picnic in was full of wildlife, including lots of critters. And it was also by some water. So I was kind of wondering if we might see a gator. Thankfully we didn't, but we did see some once we entered the museum. Now this was actually a free activity and it was so awesome. This is the Osceola County Welcome Center. This museum was super interesting and it was free. We really got to learn a lot about the history of Central Florida. The kids got to do a fun scavenger hunt. And we even got to see some live baby alligators. They were actually really cute. But I don't think I'd want to hold one. <gasps> what do you think about those, Griffin? Uh-huh, I'm, I'm scared of and I'm scared of what? I'm watching me and I'm going to go that way. <laughs> I'm trying to get away from what? you. What? There's toilet water, I'm toilet water. Whoa. Yeah, you're doing it. Is that so fun? Uh -huh. Are you a cowboy? I'm doing my head. <laughs> you're shaking your head. I hope you enjoyed this week of traveling lunches. And I want to give a big thanks to Audible for sponsoring this video. To start your 30-day trial, visit audible.com slash family fudge or text family fudge to 500 500. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.